Right guys, I'm going to hit you with some evening thoughts with Matthew. So, today I want to discuss something and I want to hear all your opinion on it. What it is, is I think my generation is going to destroy the quarter acre dream. So, before I explain that, let me explain what the quarter acre dream is. So, the quarter acre dream was our parents used to want to own a beautiful three bed, two bath, 160 square metre house on a 500 square metre section, 30 minutes from town and a nice subdivision surrounded by other nice houses and your father would spend the weekends planting a lemon tree, fixing the path to the clothesline and presenting the house beautifully. Now the reason he was doing that was that house was the measure of his success. So when his friends would come over once every two, three months, they would see that house and go, oh, John, your house looks great, your dog looks great, um, your gardens look great, you're doing really well, that's awesome. Now, let me explain to you why this generation is gonna kill that. Our success is measured differently. Our success is measured every hour, every minute. It's measured by where we go to dinner. We put it on Facebook. It's measured by where we go on holiday. We put it on Instagram. So because our success is measured constantly via our social media, we don't need that big glory investment to show how well we're doing. So now there's a catch. Instead of paying $600,000 for that beautiful house out in the suburbs, people of my generation are going to be happy to buy a far cheaper apartment in town and then use the extra money that the others would be spending on their mortgage, dining out in nicer restaurants, traveling the world, living far better quality of life day to day. So. I want to hear your thoughts on this. I want to know whether you think I'm right or not, but I think it's going to happen. I think we're going to come back to the city. We're going to live in smaller, nicer, cheaper homes and use our money to live our life to the full. Tell me what you think.